What's up everybody, Jay here from JHP. Welcome to my garage. Today we're gonna to take a look at another Funko Pop figure. Now before we get into it, at one point, we looked at a loose Gwynpool that I have. And I don't remember, but I think I might have said something about it being Gwen Stacy. And after actually reading some comic books, turns out I'm wrong about that. Gwynpool is literally a person from like the real world named Gwen Pool who got sucked into the Marvel Comics universe and became Gwen Pool. But the reason why I bring that up is because today we're going to look at Spider Gwen Unmasked, who is Gwen Stacy from a alternate Marvel universe where she got bit by the radioactive spider. And if I'm not mistaken, Peter Parker became the Punisher. So here we have Gwenpool from Marvel, pop number 152. The sticker is not on here, and it wasn't on here when I bought it, but in looking it up, this is a Walgreens exclusive of Spider Gwen Unmasked. This is a bobblehead. If we look at the back, you can see some others. Number 146 through 151, you have Spider Gwen, She-Hulk, Captain Marvel, Doctor Strange, Doc Ock, and the Falcon. And clearly these are based on their comic book looks and any character that appears in the MCU, specifically these three, is not based on their MCU look. So let's go ahead and pop open Spider-Gwen and see what we're working with here. And here we have Spider-Gwen, captured pretty well in Funko Pop form. Uh, they even made sure to get everything about her costume right, including the webbing that goes up underneath her arms. Uh, this is the unmasked form of Spider-Gwen, which if we look at the box, you can see that her mask is basically Spider-Man's mask with, a, with pink and white instead of red and black or whatever. And uh, yeah, it's just a pretty good likeness of Spider-Gwen. As best as you can do with a Funko Pop form with those gigantic, you know, squared off heads that they have. And like I said, this one is Gwen Stacy. I did my homework on this one, people. Unlike I did with Gwenpool. But it's, it's a good little addition to uh, my Marvel Pops, which consist of Deadpool, Deadpool, and more Deadpool. So now I have more than just Deadpool. So there you have it. A real quick look at Gwen Stacy as Spider-Gwen without her mask on from an alternate Marvel universe where, if I'm not mistaken, Peter Parker became the Punisher. I honestly want to read that. That just sounds weird to me that Peter Parker would become the Punisher. Anyways, I want to thank you all for watching. Please like and subscribe. Remember to always play with your kids. That's so important. And as always, I'll see you next time.